Hello everyone, how are we doing today? Uh, today is just going to be like a casual video, just want to talk about a few things and also I'm going to share you guys how I've been making gems and uh, now I've been playing this game for a while and I am completely free to play. I don't have any workers. Uh, I never bought the pack before. I never spent a penny on this on this game before. You know, maybe if they sponsor me, but <laughs> who knows if that will ever happen. Uh, and also, I'm going to also link a video for Rob Mods, and he made a, he made a few very good videos on how he has been making gems in the past before he quit. And this is like going to be like uh, an addition to that. Okay. Uh, one thing I wanted to talk about is from my last video, I got rank 3, and now I'm rank 4. Now, it's been a debate. I've been talking to the dev developers and also the official Shop Titan Discord, and even the developers don't know why someone is rank 1 versus, like, 15 or so even though everyone has the same amount of points it believe it or not it's not because of the age of the account it's not because someone who was rank one for the longest time it's not because first come first serve it believe it or not none of that matters and i confirmed each one of the arguments that they have given me they said last week they're gonna check their programming to see exactly why this person's rank 1 versus, you know, someone being rank 3 and so on. Because this person who got rank 3 and passed me, just out of nowhere, you know, came out of rank 3. Just like how when I got it, I was right away rank 3. I didn't start with 15 and so on, even though it has the same amount of points. So, I'll update that when, when they finally contact me. So... Uh, let me see, so we have finished, uh, oh, if anyone want to join my guild, you know, just let me know. We have a few inactives, and, uh, we have determined that, you know, because they changed to, like, 80,000 points, uh, we need to, um, uh, we need to have more active players, even though we have a bunch of whales, that they that are sleeping unfortunately we're gonna we're gonna have to replace a few of our whales even though we're gonna miss them but if you guys want to join our guild if you have over you know 10 to 15 billion invested just comment below i'll add you and uh we'll go on from there all right guys we're rank 354 but for us at this point we need more active than non-active so we're gonna go on just met, just comment below and let us know, okay? Also, oh, let me see. Let me finish this. Oh, a lot of people have been telling me, oh, my max hero isn't any good. Well, look at how it's gonna two hit him, to hit this hard boss, this hero right here. Two hit. I could literally have all like purple faces, but my number one rank hero. Uh, could easily two hit a hard Bleakshire boss, and I use Seiya, and uh, yeah, it's very, it's very worthy to have this warlock. I don't know why this face didn't change before, but oh well, it, it's okay. Now, how I have been making gems, uh, the number one most important thing, believe it or not, it's not you know. Uh, your shop is not um, how many spaces you have and energy you know that helps you know if you're playing for you know a while but for me the main way I have been making gems is, you know of course there's sigils there's also you know uh, you know other things but the main thing you can get gems is I'm gonna reveal it right now using the market now i think 
having all of your market slots open and usable is the most important thing you can do in the game. Uh, now, there's two ways. I have been making a lot of gems from the market, like unbelievably, unbelievably so. And always, 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 always have use every slot. Don't never leave anything. If you have available slot, never leave anything empty. You could buy, you know, legendary gears with gold uh, or with gold and gems and, and whatever the case is. Now, um, let me see one second. So here's a quick message. So, one thing, uh, what I've been you know, if you're, if you have the patience for it, is look at offers, show all offers. And what I do is not by recent, not by default, gold price, uh, gold price plus. So, I, what I do is I leave in gold price, gold price plus. And what I see is whatever the most valuable item, believe it or not, you can snipe legendary gear in the market. So I'm gonna see, show you guys. So what I do is I, I always try to refresh. You know, you could also, you know, you could go to request here, recent trades and so on. And believe it or not, you could, you could find legendary gear here or you can even show offer. Every time it loads flushing trades, it updates every single second. And you could find a lot of gear, you know, you could buy for gems for very cheap or even gold. If you have excess gold, you could easily, easily make a lot of gems, you know, even, you know, as low as 300k per gem and, and, and so on. Sniping gear, I've been doing that for <laughs> a long time. I just keep checking offers, keep checking offers and so on. See, like this is, a, you know... Every second it updates, and I think it's very important if you have the patience for it, you know. Some days I, I bought like 10 legendaries all at once, you know, someone, you might have someone, you know, trying to sell off, you know, everything. So that's one way, you know. Uh, you make it, 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 you know, six gems for, for 35 mil, that's, that's, that's insane if you have the patience to, to do that. If you want to go other way around for gems to gold and so on. So anyways, um, another thing is using your market slots. Now, as you can see, I, from my hero, I'm going to see right now. I have... Um, yeah, so this done. So I have... Let me see. So, believe it or not, guys, I have sniped this legendary item, this legendary item, this legendary item, and this legendary item. The only two I have bought for full price, 1400 gems each, is these two tier 12 items. Because they were very, they were like very hard to, like they were only in the shop, like, Sometimes there were zero available at one point, and I wanted to get rank one as fast as possible, so I bit the bullet and bought these two for full price. But you can snipe almost every legendary item using the market, and how do you do that? Now, this, like for example, this item right here, I put a request offer for 301 gems, and plus tax that could be, you know, up to like 360 gems or so on. Now, as you can see, if you try, uh, oh well, if you try to buy that same item, let's see, dagger, uh, legendary. If you try to buy this item, it's you, people are trying to sell it for 624 gems. But I'll, if I'm going to be buying it for 600 and so on, even after the taxes, even after everything. You make a quick 200 gems like that. And this doesn't have to be this item. It could be any item of value. Especially the new new rare items. That's like costing uh, 1400 gems and so on. You could request almost anything. 
Uh, let me see what else I've been requesting. Uh, let me see. Like for example, like the ones the, the ones I have sniped before. This one, Raptor. I could buy a few. Legendary. Look at the price. You know, if this is selling for 1400 gems, you just put one gem higher. Next, 715 and so on. And then, believe it or not, you, people always sell fresh. Like, every day people are selling off their legendary items for way less than they should be. So, I've been making... I've probably made at least... 40,000 plus in gem just just by doing this method alone also, you know standard selling off sigils and so on I've been crafting you know these tier 12 for two gems each, you know it's it's very important, you know have patience and uh, That's how I've been making gems this whole time and even me being free to play level 65 I have max uh, I've maxed out my shop uh, in terms of spaces. You know, I have a lot, almost every slot <laughs> slot available, and so on. I have tw 14 slots, and uh, yeah, guys. So that's how I have been making gems. So, if there's any questions, just comment, like the video, and uh, if you guys want to join the guild, just let me know and uh, enjoy, guys. Uh, I'll post as as often as I can. I can see that a lot of you guys really like my videos. So thank you for the support, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.